The thing that sets USF College of Nursing apart from others is that we truly do have interprofessional education. What drives people here is a need to be better, a need to know more, and a need to improve healthcare. We want to create a pipeline between the educational program and employment post-graduation. The nursing profession sets the table for care. We are trained with the holistic concepts of how you take care of a patient. USF Health and the College of Nursing have affiliation agreements with about 800 clinical partner entities in the Tampa Bay region and throughout Florida. We help to infuse innovation and latest thinking contemporary science into those clinical practice partner settings. In order for them to develop the competencies and the skills that they really need for excellence in clinical practice, they need to have immersion experiences in real life settings with real life patients and in the environment where they're gonna be providing care. Pinellas Hope is a very large uh, program that serves people who are homeless. The nurses coming out here, they are able to educate, they are able to help people with their medication, and having their presence here has been a great, great advantage for our program. Being my master's at USF helped me by giving me the tools that I needed to do my job. Hi, Melissa. The nurses that I hire into my unit that come from USF are the most prepared nurses to care for patients. So this disaster training that was developed by an interprofessional team of everyone at USF Health, we wanted to do it in the community setting. This gets the students to thinking, what can they do with what they have? and how can they work together as a team. So they have to form a working bond, how to communicate and how to function as a team. We have patients that are ambulatory with minor injuries. We have patients that are dead on the scene. Okay, we got two over here. They have to determine what level they are, get them from the danger level where the disaster occurred over to a, a safer area and get them ready for transport to the hospital. <laughs> The benefit and the ultimate goal for the disaster simulation is to learn to communicate with people that you're not familiar with in a stressful situation, learn teamwork and situational awareness. So they go through low fidelity simulation to where they're learning to do a task and doing it in context. And then they go through high fidelity simulation for our graduate students. This burns a little bit in your IV, okay? The feeling will go away. This is the Camel Center in Tampa, one of the largest freestanding simulation centers uh, in the United States. We're fortunate for our nurse anesthesia program to have their offices right upstairs, so our students get to come down here almost on a daily basis to work uh, with state-of-the-art simulation, technology. The Pain Fellowship started to help healthcare providers understand a little bit more about the neurophysiology of pain transmission and alternatives other than opioids and opioid therapy. Research is really about scientific discovery. We at USF Nursing pride ourselves in the distinction of being the number one uh, ranked NIH college within the state of Florida you get a strong base of skills and critical thinking skills, focusing on research and hypotheses and problem solving. What we really embed in our, all of our students is to have a questioning mind, a questioning attitude, a clinical inquiry. We're talking about research, clinical practice, education, our service mission here in the College of Nursing Ultimately, our goal is to improve care outcomes for our patients, for individual patients, as well as patient populations, to help them have longer, healthier, happier lives.